What is up everyone? Good morning first off. I took Scooby for a walk, but now I've just been on my computer just surfing the web and reading and watching quite a bit of interesting videos. One video I had watched last night was called Why I Hate School, but hold on, let me tell you real quick. It's called Why I Hate School But Love Education. It's a spoken word. And I'll put it in the description so you all can check it out. I mean, it's very, very good. The topics that he talks about, what I took from it was, just because you go to school and you learn all this, that really, how could I say it? Having, going to school and getting educated really is only one part of getting education. And education is throughout your whole life. Yesterday I bought these command hooks, these right here, and let me show you what they are. They have this side is what you press onto the clip, and then this side goes onto the wall. This this right here, we'll get a better right here on the black. Very good. And I hung up this ad right here using two hooks, and hung up this one right here using hooks in the back. And I don't even, nah, it's not even really on the wall at all. I'm glad my father told me about it because they are awesome. I was so scared about this one right here, if it was going to be able to stay up or not, because in the back, I guess somebody had bought it and took it back because the back piece was missing. It's one of those that has a leg that lay back on and stay up. But, so thankfully I got it to stay up on the wall. And the popsicle ad as well. I really like this ad. I like both of them a lot. I want to get more. But really I want to focus on. I want to print off my stuff. I'm going to print my stuff off and hang it up. As a collection. I guess I can mix it in with the other ads I buy. Last night. Oh yeah I forgot to say that I've made this little. We'll put one of the other command hooks right there. So I would not end up forgetting where my keys were. Because when I'm heading to work. And I brushed them and find out, I was like, where did I put my keys at? Did I put them, are they still in my pants? Or are they in my bag? So I just figured I might as well just hang them right here. And also to be good for when I get my car, so I can just put my car keys right there. It was funny at work yesterday. Well, I don't know if you would say it was fun, if I'd say it was funny. But there was this, these two girls, they came in and came back to the sitting room. And one of them had said to me, Mm, muscles, I need those in my life. <laughs> and I just started laughing. Because she was not my type. I'm not really into girls that are big. I'm not really into big girls at all. I mean, they're... I don't know, I guess it just depends on... How do I say this? Personality, mainly. But I'm really not into big girls, If just to say that. But I just started laughing because... It just came out of nowhere how she was saying it. And her friend was pretty cute because I would have got with her friend, but not the one that had said she needed my muscles in her life. Well, they let me leave early today. Just waiting for the bus to get across the street. I made sure to run. I ran this time to make sure that I made it. Whew. But today was good. I finally got this one chick's name. That always comes in there. And she's pretty cute too. She's from Canada. So it's like, hmm. I could have got her number, but I'll probably get it next time. Just give her a call. She is going for a PhD at Duke in English. And then I talked with another lady who went to school for commercial art. And commercial art was what they call graphic design before computers came into the mix. Well that was cool, being able to see the train go by. I recorded it, hope you all enjoyed a little bit of recorded of it because at first I wasn't fascinated with trains at all. I didn't really care about them, but 
once I learned how valuable they are to the states which they transport so many goods around that if we didn't have them a lot of things like I know grain is one that a bunch of chemicals and wine a lot of things would be hard to go on without but just walk into the house feeling great that's one cool thing about the winter is when people start putting up their lights and then after it's over you get to see who is being too lazy and how long they keep their Christmas direction, decorations up for I almost stumbled over my words there but I feel like I got a good amount of work done today I'm very proud of myself and this right here this Dobby statue I looked on eBay and seeing that it was it went from a couple hundred dollars to a couple thousand dollars and I'm trying to get all of this permanent marker off 